Well, the rain caught up with me. Still one of my favorite places to be. <laughs> Canyon, Canyon, this is Canyon Lake, Texas, by the way. Um, well, uh, the rain caught up with me, but I really want to finish this. So I'm just going to muddle through and hope it all works out. And as you can hear, I had to take shelter beneath one of these tin roof picnic tables. But hopefully you still be able to hear me. I'll try and speak up so you can. So the question we're dealing with now, I mean, we've seen or you've determined which of the propositions are live. Remember, that's something that's up to you. You've determined which are live. And we've also looked at which ones are forced. And you're pretty much all but one are forced. <clears throat> live is up to you. Forced is not. Next, we try to determine which are momentous. And momentous means that it has an impact on your life, if it's true. This does not mean that if you believe it, it has an impact on your life. Something can have an impact on your life whether you believe in them or not. Gravity is an example. The weather is an example. <laughs> I did not believe that it was going to rain today. <laughs> when, I, when I got started on this endeavor, there was a prediction on the weather report, but yeah, they make predictions all the time. They make mistakes. I didn't believe that <laughs> it was going to rain today. Uh, nevertheless, it was true it was going to rain and had an impact on my life. <laughs> so, the question is, which of these propositions are momentous? Meaning, if they're true, what impact do they have on your life? And by the way, this is also not up to you. Right? This is something independent of what you believe. So, try to figure it out. Look at the list of propositions we've had. Figure out whether there's some amazing consequence and what it would be.